Hello Taurus and welcome to my channel. My name is Tony and this time I'm gonna ask a little bit of a different question with a little bit of a different type of reading. The question is what do you need to know about this spring equinox? And um, since it's not a usual equinox I'm gonna explain in detail. On one side we have the spring equinox which talks about a brand new energy. Astrologers call it the astrological new year or the energetic new year. And because of that I decided to have three different tarot decks for all of these three different aspects of the event. And this is the first one. I'm gonna be pulling one card from it just to clarify the energy, the energy that it's going to be in the mix of your reading. So Taurus, in this case, your energy is going to be represented by this card. I'm gonna turn it upright in a moment. Then, few hours after the equinox itself, there is going to be an Aries new moon, which by itself is a brand new beginning. Aries is the first sign of the zodiac wheel and it talks about starting a brand new cycle, perfect aligning with the new beginnings that it represents and it's going to be strongly supported not only by the equinox energy that it's going to be extremely strong this time but it's going to be followed let me just pull up one card representing the new beginnings that you Taurus are going to be experiencing after this triple event let's call it and then approximately less than 48 hours after this new moon in Aries which by itself it's a brand new beginning we're gonna be having the start of a new era and it's going to be marked by Pluto entering the sign of Aquarius Pluto hasn't been in the sign of Aquarius for the last 248 years which literally means that there is no living person that has experienced this energy so we really talk about a brand new era starting for all of us and in this case for Pluto of course they have my demonic deck this is your card for it so Taurus let's have a look first <laughs> about your energy most likely you're going to be really really enlightened and aware of the fact that you're completely capable to meet all these changes. You and your energy is being presented by the magician. And the magician is someone that really manifests all the knowledge, all the information he is in contact with from the divine and materializes it on earth. This talks about a brand new beginning so your energy is absolutely perfectly aligning with any new beginning any new chapter any new era that it's going to be happening for all of us Taurus very good we have the magician representing your energy then your new beginnings are actually presented by the two of cups two of cups it's sharing your emotions values belief systems or your love with the like people, with like-minded people, it's also talking about making a choice. And in this case, if you are ready for a new start, most likely the new beginnings are going to be alliances with people just like you, Taurus. People that share and value similar things the way that you do. Two as a card of union talks about strong unions that are going to be manifested through the new beginnings or the new beginnings in your life are going to be leading to new unions with like-minded, like-hearted people. 
Torres. So, and last but not least, we have the energy of Pluto. The transformation that you're going to be experiencing starting from 23rd, 24th of March is actually going to be represent. It's represented by the Five of Wands. And this Five of Wands, it's a um, it's little bit unstable energy. And yet, it's the middle ground between the singular numbers. It's the middle between 9 and 1. So you're in the middle. It talks about crossroads, but nevertheless, you're the magician that makes the best and most appropriate unions. So it's going to be up to you where to go. Down to the 1 or up to the 9. Five of Wands, it's a fiery energy, so it might be talking about your belief systems or your passions. So you're gonna be on a scale in between many options that this Pluto transit and this deep psychological transformation is going to be delivering in your life and in your world, Taurus. So let's see, I'm gonna be pulling one card from the major Arcana deck just to see what your mission might be in this time period Taurus and then I'm gonna summarize so let's pull one and it's gonna be this one wow Taurus this is the tower and this is the card that says expect the unexpected the positive side of this card and I know that you might be thinking oh Tony you are crazy there is no positive side in this card but actually I always take it as a very positive energy because this is the force that comes to destroy all the illusions all the nonsense towers that you might have in your life and if I get back to the passions the beliefs the talents your eternal fire whatever doesn't belong to you Taurus it's going to be immediately and unexpectedly destroyed by this energy. Your mission, actually, I believe, in the next few months up till the fall equinox, is going to be to destroy all illusions, all belief systems that are part of the nonsense idea that you might be having in any area of your life. And the good part is that at the same time, you're going to be supported by your understanding of your own abilities to manifest any new beginning that you would like to have, solid, real, new beginning I'm talking about, and not a imaginatory one. And on top of that, by doing that, you're going to be attracting alike people like-minded people or you might even get to find real love in the process Taurus this is all wonderful and very very positive and yes there are some negative aspects to it but I believe that all is going to be ending really really good if not better for you Taurus that's all I have for you for the Equinox this year. Let me know how you feel about this reading. Thank you for your time, Taurus.